Silhouette Studio Designer Edition has a nesting feature that takes your shapes and automatically rearranges them on your work page to minimize the amount of space required to cut those designs. You can find the nesting panel in Designer Edition along the right-hand side of the page, which looks like interlocked combs. You have the option to either use the cut area or to make your own boundary into which you want your shapes to fit. The cut area will be your page size or the cutting area of a print and cut. If you want to make your own boundary, simply draw a shape and choose Set Selected Shape as Boundary and you'll see it change to a blue outline. Now you have a few ways to choose which shapes to nest. If you don't select any designs and check the box for Only Shapes on Media, then only those on your virtual mat will nest. Click Nest and you'll see how they fill the nesting boundary. If you uncheck Only Shapes on Media, then all shapes you have open will nest. Finally, you can select just the shapes you want to nest. Checking the box for Align will take similar shapes and attempt to sort and align them as efficiently as possible. Padding puts additional space between each nested image as the setting is raised. Rotations restricts or allows additional rotation angles. While the highest setting tries to make the most effective use of space, you might want to keep it lower to hold images at a certain angle. That's it for the nesting feature in Silhouette Studio Designer Edition.